Look what I got in my mail today. Another parcel. Hey everyone, how are all of you? This is Blader Sedge, back with another awesome video for this week. So before unboxing this package, I want to tell you something. As you can see here, this package has already been opened by me in order to check what was inside. And one more thing also. This is not a sealed package. It has been already opened up by the seller. Maybe he did it to check what was inside or the contents inside were genuine, authentic or not. But he has already told me that he has opened up the package. So it is not a sealed box package. That is what I want to tell you before unboxing it. Now I will start by removing up this bubble wrap. So here is our Beyblade Legends Lightning El Drago BB43 As I have told in my previous unboxings the thing written over here is not same It was written in the previous packaging as baybattlesonline.com but here it is it has been written in some other language Combats and Line Battle and Linea so they could be different according to the region or country maybe it is from some other country that is why there is a difference even there are three different types of attack written here in different languages in the previous one there was only one written attack in english here three have been written here is the picture of el drago lightning here are all the parts. Language is different in this one. It's some other language I'm not aware of. These product line was same in the previous packaging. These seven blades have been given on the side. Here is the motif of El Drago. And it is manufactured by Hasbro as it is written here. So from here you can see that this is not a sealed package. It has been opened up previously. I am not sure of why seller did that. But he said that he is selling me an authentic item. So I trust him. And I have purchased it from Mr. Alappan who lives in India. So I will now start opening up this package. I don't need to slice it off this time because it is already opened up. Let's keep them by the side. Let's see if there is something on this side. It was stuck by something there. That is why force was trying to remove it. All right, leaving it. So the winder with this one is a little bit different. It is a dragon winder instead of round one. The length of the winder in Hasbro launchers is short in comparison to the Takara Tommy ones. The length of them is a little bit shorter. And here is the white light launcher that comes with the El Drago. It is the standard launcher. It is not a powerful one. Grip is really good on this light launcher. 
and the feel and pull out is also smooth so here is the launcher and the ripcord what else is in the packaging instruction manual and a unlocking tool it is a blue color this time dark blue actually here is the instruction manual which I won't go in detail though I like these instruction manuals so for the reason how well they have been designed really good here are the parts mentioned as it was mentioned on the back of the package lightning El Drago BB 43 some other things have been written in other language which we ha don't have to go in details here's the Beyblade Legends all those standard things have been written I won't go in detail now we will have a look at all of the parts so the main part is this face bolt as you can see it is not a stickered face bolt this is the speciality of Hasbro Legends line that they provide tattooed stickered face bolts sorry for the interruption so as I was saying these face bolts they come with tattoo design they do not come with the stickers this is the specialty of Hasbro Beyblade Legends line and here is the fusion wheel the lightning it looks a little grayish and used but that's not much of a problem for me Here is the energy ring El Drago 1. So like all other El Drago Beyblades, this one also has the ability to spin steel from its opponents. So the dragon heads are pointing downwards in this one and there is no rubber around it as it is in the Meteor El Drago and the El Drago Destroy which I have unboxed before and the uh, there are red linings on the top of the energy ring so as I have told before the parts of Hasbro do not have stickers included in them and here is the track 100 which is a pretty standard track comes in a lot of Beyblades so if you are not having this one you have an opportunity to get it from a lot of Beyblades and finally it is the whole flat HF there is a hole in the center of the tip which provides it the flat formation but as a result of which stability is affected somewhat but it increases the stamina so that was our whole flat tip now let's put the Beyblade back together
So here is our pea blade assembled and ready to spin. I really like the design of this one in comparison to the others and mainly because of there are no stickers on this one which I want because when they start to wear down they leave a whitish kind of residue which I don't like at all. So here was our Lightning El Drago 100 flat, 100 hole flat. Now I will give it a test print to see how it performs. It's supposed to go the other way around. As you can see it is a little less aggressive than the previous Storm Pegasus but there is somewhat aggression in it. But it spins for a longer time in comparison to the previous one. So there is one advantage of that. So that was the test spin for Lightning El Drago 100 hole flat. If you enjoyed the unboxing then don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel so that I could bring more awesome content for you to watch in the future. With that said I will see you next week. Until then, stay tuned and have a nice day.